Something else is very useful to have. If we have a lightsaber, well, we need the proficiency to wield a lightsaber. So let's take a look at our feet list here. And the first thing we need to be out of anything is force sensitive. There we go. Now we can use force powers. So while we could add any old feat we want here, let's see, weapon proficiency in lightsaber. Oh, proficiency, here we go. Now we can do the lightsaber. But why stop there? It lets you click and drag to select multiple feats and lets you add them. We have all these weapons for a human female. Let's give ourselves weapon focus on all the weapons here. Let's give ourselves oh how about master everything? Sure. Well, let's go ahead and give ourselves a class of Jedi. Normally we have to wait in the game, as you may recall, to uh, choose what color lightsaber crystal you want. You gotta go all the way through Terrace before you can even build your lightsaber for Master Vandar and Vruk and all those stuffy old Jedi Council people. Let's go ahead and just make myself a Jedi Guardian now, such that every time I will level up, I can add Force Powers. Shoot, I can add Force Powers right here. Let's give myself Throw Lightsaber. Here's this little button right here that says Show Everything. And this shows you some things that they didn't even... Uh, put in until the other game, or didn't even give you at all. Like Sonic Howl, they never even implemented that in the game. We can see that here. A winning, whirling dervish. You see, you can see stuff that the developers were thinking of, but never had a chance to implement. Dominate Mind. They thought about it in KOTOR 1, but they didn't put Dominate Mind until KOTOR 2. This might mess up your game a bit if you try to put these in your save. You're just kind of here to just look around. But there's nothing wrong with giving yourself... Master. Sure. Some of these items shouldn't be appearing in Force Powers. So I'm not going to select those here. What was a level 3 med pack too? I don't know. Gravity generators? That's a droid weapon here. Force storm. Sure. And commit the changes. Save successfully. Alrighty then. Eco tour game. Let's go ahead and load up what we modified. Game 1. And load. See what happens when we load it now. Sure enough, we are Bastila in her slave outfit there. Now let's get what's in the footlocker. Sure, what the hell. Come on, we have to hurry. The Sith might already be boarding the ship to try and capture Bastila. Put your equipment on so we can get out of here. But... But I am Bastila. <laughs> okay. But seriously though, let's see it. Oh, what the hell? Let's put on clothes on Bastila. Boring, but yes. Well, let's give a lightsaber. And let's give Malik's lightsaber and Bastila's other hand here. I didn't give her anything else, but what else do you need if you get that? Okay, let's move out. We should stick together. You'll have more success with the party than... And blah blah, the whole party thing. Because of the... Okay. You always control... Left... Left click... Blah blah blah. Right. 
I got keyboard controls for the uh, main character here. Hmm? Now that the door is open, you just can kick your ass. Alrighty. Get out of the way. By the way, it's uh that's right, bitches. Let's go ahead and level her up here. Look, she's full light side, just like I wanted to. Let's go ahead and normal level up. That's right. 1.5 million experience points. Inventory. All those credits. Yes, they are there. So, leveling up Bastila. All right then. Okay, leveling up our main character, Jessica Kigas. What does to look like at Basila, even though she really isn't? I want to try to. Uh, here you go. If you click, you can see your rotate. So uh, let's go ahead and level up skills. Sure, doesn't matter what we choose because we can add these all through the game save editor later. Powers. Let's see, what we gave her was, remember, Master Speed and Master Valor. Then Force Immunity. Which power else should we give her? See, we gave her Force Storm too. Let's go ahead and we can give her anything way advanced through that game save editor. So, just for your giggles, let's go ahead and cure. Or recommend it. Stunt. Sure, why not? We could keep on leveling her up here. We can just auto-level up. Sure, what the hell. And the character looks like this. And oddly enough, it didn't spend a single experience point. It's kind of weird, but uh, of course you can't level up Trask. 